Ain't got his full drive. <sighs> You can see that, guys. In there, big red belly black. He's about a six footer down there. I was just getting out of the car to suss out the walk in front of me. Look down. There's a monster sitting down there. Anyway, I'm going to try and shoot him away so we can get past without running him over. Standing on the bottom of the, the bull bar of the car, get a better look at this guy. He's quite fat there, I can only see half of him. But, yeah. I'm gonna try and make, get him, throw something at him, try and get rid of him. Welcome back, old hunters. We're out in the bush again. Something different this trip. Gonna wet the old sluice. So I've, I've uh, pulled up with the boys. As you saw, we saw a nice red belly back there. Uh, yeah, they're starting to come out a bit. Haven't seen one for ages. Anyway, we pulled up just here. You can see behind me, there's a big pit right there. A few pits in the bush and stuff here. There's a creek about 50 metres through the bush there. We're about to head down and check it out. Hopefully there's enough water flow and get a bit of gold. All right, down the creek, guys. We're all, uh, you know what? We've got a couple of sluices set up. The boys got one set up there. I've got one set up here. I just, that crack right there, did a bit of a scrape out. Do a quick test pan to, uh, you yeah. know, so if there's any gold, obviously. And there was. Check this out. First pan. Not bad. Not bad at all. And uh I haven't even sucked it dry. I literally just got the pick, moved the big rocks out, and uh yeah, scraped a bit out with the pick into the scoop and put it in the pan. So happy days. Alright, the boys got the sluice going. Just uh they're getting a bit of dirt up from beyond the big rock up the back there. Chris and uh, Hamish is doing a bit of digging in the bank over the side there. And he's feeding it through here. We've seen some nice chunkies in the top so far. It's nice, dirty looking material, which is good. Got a good flow here on the 8 inch gold rat. Can't get a better sluice than the old gold rat. Working quite well. Anyway, keep going. We'll give you a look at what they get later when they clean up. Always about to do a clean up. Oh yeah, a couple of nice pieces in the mat. You can see that on camera. There's the glare. So around. Right there. Where's my finger? Right, the tip of my finger there. There's a nice piece. There's a couple of other pieces floating around in there too. Another one there. Anyway. Yeah, it's a clean up. See how they went. Four buckets. Yeah, let's clean up. Bit of four buckets. So far. Through it so far, they just did a clean up to make sure they were getting a bit of gold. And yeah, it's nice, not bad at all. Worth keep going back, gold hunters. Second day, we had a quick one yesterday. We got down a bit late and uh, yeah, got a little bit down the sluice. So we come up up the creek a fair way up this gully and uh, we just uh, got a you see behind me that we're right on the on the bend, sharp bend here. So we're there's a big rock here, we're working on the inside of the bend, and uh, we're getting a few chunkies in the pans. Here look. Ugh, not bad pieces, because they're coming out every every pan or so, so it's adding up pretty quick. And uh, yeah, good bit of water, which is good. So, keep going, we'll hopefully pull some good stuff. Back up at camp, we'll make up for a bit of lunch, the feed. Just having a look at what we got so far today in the pans between us. Nice chunky stuff's coming out. A um, bit of devil's dice. There's quite a few devil's dice around here at the moment, where we are. Yeah. Doing all right so far? Morning, gold hunters. Uh, today, me and Anthony uh, are giving the creek a break. The old pan gets a bit hard on the old back. But uh, yeah, I'll show you what we got the creek later. We did all right. So anyway, come for a walk um, with the detectors this morning. See if we can find any gold nuggies. Oh, well, gold hunters. After just having that screaming target before, I, I'll show you, I didn't film it. I got this, uh, oh, where's she going? Musket ball. Dug a hole to China. Check that out. 
I was sure that was that was a big bit of gold. It was so so deep, it sounded so good. I dropped it in the scoop and it was like so heavy, but yeah, disappointing. But still pretty cool find. So anyway, had another screaming target, like blanking. Listen to this. Full blanking target. I was thinking, oh, another bit of trash. But it wasn't. Check this out. <laughs> Look at that. That's a chunk. Proper chunk. You. That's got to be a few grams, maybe. Two and a half, three grams. Oh, I'm fucking stoked. You. Back up at camp, uh, just doing a bit of a final weigh-in for the day, or for the weekend, sorry, Anzac weekend. So, between five of us on the detectors, two detectors and panning in the creek, we didn't do too bad at all. So that's our total for the weekend. The cracker I picked up this morning, uh, I'll give you a look at it, how much he weighs us, but... So yeah, not too bad at all, so... We've got... Let's have a look. Take these back off. See how much we got in the pans. So, 1.8 grams on the pans. And that big nugget I got today, 3.1 clunker. Not a bad trip at all. Good trip out with the boys. Anyway, don't forget to give us a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next trip.